Hey Leo, let's get you started for October 2023. This is the third time I'm going to be doing this video because my puppies keep barking in the background. Right now they're watching Kath and Kim. Do you guys remember that show? Or do you ever see it? It's on like Netflix. It's Australian. It's funny as shit. So let's see what's going on for you. And don't forget to hit like, share, subscribe, comments, and utterances of discontent will be met with love and humor. Oh, I hope I can get through this one with no barky, 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 barky. This is looking pretty good. This is looking pretty good, Leo. I'm going to tell you what. Maybe it was meant to be. Maybe it was meant to be. Um, yeah, similar themes as the other one. And don't forget, I'm going to be doing your tarot cards. going to be doing your astro dice, which are available in my store. And then we're going to be doing the witch cards also. So stay tuned for all three. And don't forget to subscribe because you get this every single month for free. I give you about 10 minutes, go over the whole entire month, health, wealth, love, and happiness. Tell you about the specials. Tell you about new things gonna, that are going to be going off. And, you know, you get you get everything you need. I mean, come on. Who wouldn't want this? So let's hop into it. So in the recent past, you had a situation. I think you're kind of on the come down from summer. I think summer is actually a really good time for you. Um, and it even shows that in, like, September, uh, August, September time period is when things, you know, August is your month, really. You know, it really, really is. Uh, end of July, into August is your month. But it's like you kind of had to... You know, chillax, do something. September ramped up work, ramped up a lot of things, like things you need to work on for yourself, things you need to do for your career, maybe even school. And it could be that you're working on a relationship because there are a couple things here that I don't love with a relationship. Your base card is the Ace of Cups in reverse, which is like the love card in reverse. So if we're talking about health or we're talking about money or we're talking about anything like not, you know, like that, okay, like a thing, that's going to say that you're not in a good place right now. If we're actually talking about love, 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 this could be either somebody you don't feel loved or somebody is going to be leaving. Okay. So this is eh, something you, you know, you might want to, you might want to listen here and your crown, which is what you think about all the time is the 10 of swords. That's also a heartbreak card. That's not good. That's not good. So if you think you're in a really good place with your relationship in October, um, probably not. Probably not. You might want to look at some things. It doesn't mean that there's necessarily going to be a breakup. It doesn't mean that things are always, they're going to completely go to hell. That's not what it means. But it, it can mean you really need to look at stuff. You need to um, honestly look at things, not just how somebody maybe um, shows you stuff, because people aren't always honest in relationships, even if you've been married for 25 years. People aren't always telling you the truth. They might say, oh, yeah, yeah, everything's great, and, you know, it's not. So you need to definitely take a deep dive into how you feel in the relationship and how this other person is feeling. Now, if this is a business thing, this can be a business partnership or this could be a company, okay? So it could be like your company is gonna break up with you or your company is not happy or you wanna break up with your company. You know, that's, it's the, you read it the same way. But if this is a love relationship situation, situation, you definitely need to take a deeper dive into what is actually going on. Make sure to dot your, um, eyes and cross your teeth. I was going to say reverse because I said diet cheese, cross your eyes, but you know what I'm saying. Um, also in the heart card, there is this work thing. I don't want you to put too much work into it. I don't want you to be the only one working on a relationship or even a work situation. This is something where it has to be, it'd be a two way street. And then going into the future, we got the three of swords in reverse, which again, I think you may wonder if there's a cheating element or if there's a third party or there's a somebody else. I don't think so. I think you're going to come to find out that no, there isn't just so you know. And then we have the emperor in reverse. The Emperor card is actually tied heavily to Leo and this card is in reverse. So you might kind of get thrown for a loop here. You, and this is, this is why you need to listen to these so you can prepare ahead of time. So you're not caught off guard and you're not like what the, f you know, for the rest of the year. So this is something you definitely want to keep an eye out for. Make sure you're watching what everybody's doing. Maybe even, I don't want to say set the person up, but maybe, you know, uh, find stuff out and then ask them questions to see how truthful they're being to you. Again, this can be a love relationship or a boss. Okay, it doesn't have to be. So these are from, these are the astro dice. We're going to switch into the astrology now. These are in my Etsy store. you got to check my Etsy store out. Loading all this cool new stuff for Halloween. It is so badass. Getting more and more stuff in all the time. Um, trying to do about a listing a day. Probably about, you know, five to seven listings a week to keep up. But these are in my store. It is the... Astrodice comes with this cheat sheet, which if you are 
new here, please subscribe because 95% of my viewers apparently are not subscribed. So subscribe, that'll help me out. But if you are a regular viewer, you know, I need this. It, it's a cheat sheet that comes with these. I need these because uh, I am blind as a bat, but you get, it has the um, astrological symbols. It, ha it has, um, I'm sorry, yes, has the astrological symbols, has the planets, and it has the, I reverse that. My eyes are not working today for crap. How's the zodiac? Um, zodiac symbols and the planets. Okay. So you can get a full reading with this. So we're going to see what's going on for you for October. This is in my store along with a whole bunch of really cool candles, mystical products, magical products, spells, spell work, all sorts of stuff. And you can get consultations with me down there for whatever you want. I have three um, text readings and I have three over the phone readings. So anything you could possibly want. So we got ninth house in Aquarius with a uh, Jupiter situation here. So let's look at that. So ninth house is definitely, definitely, definitely about this journey you're on and definitely about teaching yourself something. Ninth house is a big educate is a big learning house. Okay. So you're going to be learning something big in October. Uh, here's the thing. I don't want you to learn a horrible secret. I don't want you to learn like the terrible truth about somebody. I want you to learn to trust yourself and I want you to learn how to move forward and move through the stuff that you're going to be going through. Okay. It's not terrible. As long as you prepare, it's going to be a nothing burger. But if you don't prepare, you're going to be like, holy shit, like, where did this come from? And Jupiter is going to keep you straight. J Jupiter is all about luck and optimism and, you know, all that really good stuff. Jupiter's a really benevolent planet. So it's, you almost have like a guardian angel going into all this stuff and you're going to have success. But again, Jupiter is another planet of education. So just know in October, you're going to be learning a huge lesson. Now Aquarius is, is, you know, it's our, it's our air sign. People always think it's a water sign, but it's not, but it is our air sign and it is ruled by Uranus and Uranus will, um, turn things on its head. That's the nicest way I can put it. It's, it's the weirdo planet. It's the weird, like something unexpected is going to happen. But Aquarius is again about you being in your consciousness. Okay. Your inner knowing you're like, Oh, sh I shouldn't have seen that coming. So it's definitely a planet that's going, it's definitely uh, a, a planet, a house and a sign that are all showing you like things are going to come to a head. Things are going to come to a head one way or another. Now, again, this does not mean you have to break up. So don't, don't, don't watch this and be like, oh my God, you're saying we're going to break up. No, it could be a fight. It could be, um, it could be a discussion that leads to a greater understanding. It could be, you know, you come up with a deal breaker and you're like, oh no, I can't, I can't deal with this, you know? Uh, and the, again, can be a company can be a family member, can be a specific person. I want you to go ahead and skip down below because right down there is my personal phone number, 484-634-0435. You can text me, don't call me, but if you text me, we can do a reading and we can find out specifically how this, what this has to do with you, okay? So now I'm gonna move on to your witch card, your moon witch cards. And these are super cool. I finally took them out of the pack. If you watch the other videos, like... I'm, I'm struggling with the pack. And don't forget that Leo is just your sun sign. You have a moon sign and a rising sign also. So you can go ahead online, put in your um, birth date, your birth time, the time of the day. It has to be AM, PM. And you got to know, I think to pretty much the hour, um, hour and minute would be ideal. And you have to know where you were born. Some websites want you to do the exact town and some are just kind of like what time zone, you know? So have some general idea, and then you can do your rising sun and your moon sign, get those and come back and watch all of those because Leo is your sun sign and Leo is in the, uh, Leo, Leo was ruled by the sun. So that's a wonderful thing. Okay. So new moon, fresh start in the beginnings. Yeah. There's going to be something here where you're, you, it's a lot of people and there's, there's a lot of different astrology going on because as I'm filming this, there is a uh, full moon in Aries. There is a lot of like clean slate energy going on. And you're going to have that in October. You're going to have a clean slate. So what you want to do with it is completely up to you. Okay. If you want to stay with the person, if you want to move on from this person, if you want to stay with this job, if you want to move on for this job, whatever you want to do, it is going to be completely up to you. Please don't feel like it's somebody else's call. It is a hundred percent your call. Now, if you want to go over anything at all, like I said, my phone number is right down below, 484-634-0435. Go ahead and text me. Also, go to all my different social media. My social media will have a, a, like all sorts of stuff, links to stuff, and then you sign up here because then this will be delivered to your inbox every single month completely for free. I will never charge for these. You get 10 bucks, you get 10, yeah, 10 bucks. You get 10 minutes free every single month where I go over all of your health, wealth, love, and happiness. And I have sales 
for on spell work. I have sales on spell kits. I have sales on all my different products. I have just ran out on readings. I have random pop-up sales all the time. So you're going to want to check out the social media to definitely, ch you know, find out when that's happening. All the different social medias, I'm going to have it posted on different ones at different times. So you want to hit those up whenever you can. And if you're a Halloweenian like me, don't forget, I got all the cool Halloween stuff. If you go to my Mercari, I got all the cool Halloween nails because uh, I love a nail. These were originally out to here. So if you want them longer, I do have them for sale on the Mercari. Just Google me, Mama Delia, M-O-M-A-D-E-L-I-A. I am absolutely everywhere under that name. And there you go. Have a great day, Leo. Thank you so much.